properly. One, go! <laughs> hey everybody, welcome to the final match for me in this tournament of shame. <laughs> Preliminaries. Is something funny? Is there no. something amusing about- No, everything about this is normal at this point. Yeah. We're good. It's, it's not like you did a silly voice just before starting the countdown. <laughs> no, none of that Yo, happened. Yo, they have all. no way- they have no way of knowing that unless That's you tell them. They have no proof at all. Nick of anything. Nick was impersonating Snake from Metal Gear and was top notch. I was mm -hmm. trying to do Duke Nukem and apparently it was Apparently I'm is okay, so like let's let the audience do decide. Again? Yeah, do I it guess, all right. right? Because So Dan thinks this is <laughs> Duke Nukem. <laughs> you changed it up. You changed styles up on him. And it's not. <laughs> it's kind of Duke Nukem. It's got that screen over it. It is Dan thinks this is Duke Nukem. <laughs> but I'm here to tell Dan. It's that Macho it's Man not. Randy Savage. It's, it's closer to Macho Man Randy Savage. Yeah. No, I'll tell you no, what it sounds like. It sounds like Bebop and Rocksteady. Dude, your turn! Dan! Yo. Dan! <laughs> no! Wait, that's a done. fantastic start. <laughs> <laughs> Oh I'm, no! I'm just giving well, the, them into a false sense Damn of confidence. Damn, Daniel! Sure, yeah, they need it. They're the two most experienced players in the no! game. No, Rob. Rob sense. is more experienced than I am. All right. I overshot it. Oh! Wow! Okay. All right. It looks like we know who we're going for. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, try now. Oh God! How do you like them apples, Duke? <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> So Dan thinks Duke really this is Duke like Nukem. <laughs> hey, everybody, it's Duke Nukem. <laughs> I'm here to kick ass and chew bubblegum. Not right, I'm Dirk Nukem. <laughs> Did somebody there, say Dirk Nukem? Showdown, like you were doing the announcer voice there a little no, bit. No, I was, uh, what's his name? Fucking, oh, I had it before. George Gray. Uh, Price is right, announcer. Oh, okay. oh. Yeah. Why did you go George Gray instead He's of? He's the new one. What? Who's the old one? It's like I don't know. Rod, Rod Roddy. Right. Yeah, something like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> All these and more can be yours in this exciting showdown. <laughs> come on down. He does say, "Come on down." <laughs> he he just says it a lot. Yeah. It's kind of his line. Mm -hmm. Ooh, what is the shadow? Baby. Man? Shot wow! The shadow. Right it's around the center. The shadow. Hey, Nick. Nick. Yeah. Would you take offense if yeah. one of your friends imitated you? <laughs> <laughs> no, you're you're entitled to do whatever you need. No, no, I'm being fine. serious. I'm I'm not naming any names. But would you have been offended if that were to happen? Yeah, there's no names to name. No. Dan asked me to do an impression of you, and I said I w didn't want to do it. You might take it the wrong but way. But the context was this was right after he did an impersonation of Mathis. I'm like, well, that's insulting that you would do one for Mathis and not for Nick. So that would have been in the safe zone, right? Yeah, you're fine. Yeah. Oh. Oh no. Hey everybody. I went completely. Who's that? Smile. Oh okay. Dude, that doesn't sound anything like me. What are you talking about? Like, you're not even trying. Yeah. You're, you're, you're trying to be generous. To... I think. I'm not trying. You're doing a trying. Nick to Nick. That's what you just did. <laughs> Saying, oh, I, I can't hit this shot. I can't hit. This. Oh, it's just a little luck. No, that's what you just did to him. Because you can hit the Nick impersonation. Dan's you're just you got the foot closer. off the gas. Oh, wait, Dan has a Nick? I want to hear Dan's Nick. I'm way more aware than I think you think I am about the nasalness wow. of my voice and such. No, that's not that's not a, that's a Ryan impersonation when he gets all Wikipedia what on us. What the fuck did you just shoot at me? I shot you with a twinkle twinkle little star. That was Nick, no, I, was somewhere. I wouldn't pass oh, the oh, aggressive fireworks. imitate someone. Just so you know. <laughs> <laughs> I only do that when Ryan starts breaking out useless facts that he knows. What about it? Aggressive, aggressive. <laughs> Here's my impression of Dan. Oh, uh, the capital of South Dakota is Billings. <laughs> it's not. Oh. Nice it's shot. Pierre. See, and this is where I would technically go into impersonating Ryan because he just happens to know every U.S. capital. <laughs> <laughs> How is that an impression of me? Because when you get pontificating, that's, that's what you sound like. I remember Ryan <laughs> talking like this in his early video. <laughs> hey everybody, it's Northern Lion here with the Super Meat Boy run. Oh he man. Was, 
He was Yo. way more chill sounding back then, though. Like, oh, he left yeah, more no, he air was, in his voice. He was since token, when, man. That's for sure. Since when did Duke Nukem start doing impressions of me? <laughs> <laughs> it's time to break eggs and chew bubblegum, and I'm all out of eggs. <laughs> that seems like good breakfast. news for me. That's Snake. You do a great Snake. Is it really Snake? Yeah, no, it's people are going to confuse you with David How do like, I David turn into Duke? I don't know about your perception of how people sound, man. <laughs> <laughs> Who, me? I oh. want to up my, my Duke game, man. I actually, I played so much Duke, I think I could do an impression of him. You better all Duke. Things. I, I left to. a pretty sweet Duke in the toilet this morning. <laughs> nice. We I heard. remember that. You were talking about it. Yeah. yeah. Probably from all that Ikea bread. <laughs> It might have been, honestly. Ikea bread <laughs> does make you shit. Everyone oh, knows that. What, what like are you man. talking about? Like, you just went to Ikea to just get bread? <laughs> no, I got furniture, and then there was bread, so I got the bread. Just bread, though. Like, yeah. no, no, I, no, I got no a bookshelf. There's no I got a bookshelf and a glass no, I'm not, no, I'm not concerned about, like, your whole trip to Ikea. I'm talking about when you went to the food section of Ikea, right? <laughs> well, you, we didn't just get bread. You ordered First bread. off. The bread was not in the food section. It was in the. It was on the staircase. There was like a display for it. It wasn't even in the okay, food section. Okay, no, there was just a oh, loaf of bread on there. <laughs> yeah, we just picked it up. <laughs> Maybe a triple. Oh damn! Hold on. Did they have like a bread-sized bag? Because I wasn't aware. Because most of the things they sell are massive. What are you talking about? Bread-sized bag is bread. They put it in an appropriate container. It's not anarchy. I'm still wondering. They, what kind of bread is it? It's Chris it's bread. It's an unleavened Chris Chocolate bread. Chocolate Mork. <laughs> Chocolate Mork. <laughs> oh, Are you kidding me? There we go. I like that. Every single it bounced on top of your <laughs> head like four time. times. <laughs> you know when you're playing basketball and you just like hit the ball back and forth between your hands a couple of times in the air yeah. to be like, oh, look at this. That's exactly what happened there, Bear. That sounds about right. A little showmanship. Mm-hmm. Man, let's go, bear. We got this. We're on the ropes. Let's go, Was bear. it good? Did let's it taste go. good? The bread is delicious. We wouldn't be talking about it all this time if it didn't taste. Ryan's good. the type of guy if he bought bread that wasn't good, but there was a story behind it. Be like, yeah, it's great. I love it. I, I great. Oh, That's bullshit, Dan. You would just to save the <laughs> That's story. That's bullshit, Dan. You would be the first to know if this bread sucked. I agree with that. I think uh, he, he takes a pretty hard stance on bread, man. That's I true. know enough about Ryan to know that you will hear about all bread related <laughs> issues. <laughs> Absolutely fucking true. Sometimes Look, nobody's got times. nobody's got time for bad bread. Oh, that was a great shot. Oh, thanks, Dan. Well done. Oh, I thought that was Nick that shot that. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, I got moons. And I'm not gonna get to use them. Yeah, I mean, moons I get I get earthquake you. Here. Earthquake you into some moons, maybe. I'm reach out and quake you. I'm going for the headshot. Headshot. Is that a sniper? Oh, headshot. oh great shot! Oh. Ooh, feeling a little wet all of a sudden. <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny? Uh, just sounds, man. Just generally, it's mostly just sounds. <laughs> I find them amusing. <laughs> you generally oh, set up wet? Well, Nick, I mean, yeah. Nick, I hope you don't think <laughs> I'm impersonating you. I would, that's, that makes me sad. Because then, I don't what? know. Because that's not the truth. Uh, and it makes me sad if you think that was impersonating Oh, no. Nice kill. Me? Yeah. You think I think you're impersonating you? I Why? Do you think I'm impersonating <laughs> you when I do the the Ryan Know It All voice? Uh, yeah. He's the dude is the playing a dude disguised as another dude. No, I ne that never crossed my mind. Yeah, okay. It's Kirk Lazarus from Tropic Thunder. <laughs> I wrote it kind of is. Oh yeah, I hear that. Bear. Yeah, we'll go for that. Got this, bear. I'm gonna try. Oh, that's a one. There we, go. there we go. <laughs> the infinite portal switch. You just get like a thousand XP if you hit that shot. Yeah, honestly. Look at Ryan. Just it should continually build up momentum and then just like destroy half the level at some point. Here's what I'm doing. 
I'm doing moons, okay. and I'm going to do it gently and to the right, and hope that their momentum carries them back down with a lot of force. What? The oh. Heck? Oh, I wow. got one. Oh, that was weird. That was interesting. Very that was very interesting. It's like a lunar shotgun, ideally. You yeah. don't want to give them time to space out. Well, Nick, don't what you know the last lunar, lunar moon was March 17, 2009? <laughs> <laughs> when both the last, the last lunar, lunar moon. moon. <laughs> Dan, please, what is a lunar moon? I, I want to know more. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's Bear, the I believe. Lunar moon. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm guessing this is what this does. Let's see. Yep. Oh, oh, Nick! What a shot! Nick did well, the Nick setup there. It's a dead yeah. weight just in reverse. I'm I never use that move in I'm air quoting. I'm guessing what this does, Nick. Yeah. See, <laughs> now you understand. She was on the other foot. <laughs> I hadn't used it before. It oh well, it's hard to aim. You got to click on the person, and then it just automatically does a hundred damage. <laughs> I didn't it's know only how on, it works. It's only unlocked at level twenty, but uh, I think that the early weapons in the game are the best, honestly. Great shot. Man. That, that was Rob, actually. I said that. That was Rob. You're all you're all in the same boat, as far as I'm concerned. You're all the same person, basically. Ryan, can you do a Rob impersonation? In particular, when he signs out. Hey everybody, this is Alpaca Patrol saying goodbye. Peace, fools. <laughs> signing out. Alpaca Patrol it. signing out. Signing out. He even Peace, said fools. Well, I don't, I don't listen to a word he says, to be honest with you. That's fair. <laughs> Come on, bear, stay out of the rain. All right, there we go. All right, little, little by little, I'm, I'm gonna get back in this. Are I'm you little, kidding me? I'm a little biased. Just I think, drop. I think your favorite, your Fucking best let one the is powers Mathis. of gravity take over. I will I will roll head first into that health if you let me. Just god damn it. All right. It's a safety mechanism. They won't let you. <laughs> They're trying to protect me. <laughs> it's a safety mechanism. All right, popcorn. Oh, that's actually really strong. Oh. Don Cheadle. Why oh, Don no. Cheadle? Oh no. I have to know. Why Don Cheadle? Because yeah, it's popcorn, does. I associate popcorn with good movies, and good movies equals Don <laughs> Cheadle. <laughs> yeah, Hotel Rwanda about the genocide in Africa, that was a real popcorn muncher right there. <laughs> oh my god. Muncher of the popcorn, haven't you ever seen <laughs> no, they, play, they played a video game in Rain Over Me, so I mean, there's at least like a little relation, right? Yeah. And then he's in <laughs> Ocean's <laughs> Twelve. Yeah, stab you. Yeah, you know, like... Ralph Fiennes, I really love in Schindler's Lynch. Schindler's what? List. What? Schindler's List. When he's saving all. Of... Oh my <laughs> Yo, god! That would be, I do not want to be associated with the... the contents of this video. That's that's the sequel where he gets brainwashed oh by the remaining god. members of the Nazi Nazi regime. Right. Nazi. <laughs> the not the nacho cheese regime. Oh god. <sighs> this Nick, you better finish the job here, man. We gotta, we so. gotta get out of this episode quick, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm out of this one. <laughs> Dude, that would be a great sequel, though. You gotta admit. Would it be? <laughs> uh, great might not be the right word, but it's... Well, I mean, absurd. Memorable, I'd yeah, say, probably. Memorable. <laughs> <I like laughs> memorable. How'd I do? Oh, God. There How'd you I do? Good yeah. job. Nick. Sweet. I nearly took one of you with me, man. I feel pretty good about that. Bear, if you had any help from John Stockton over here, I think we would have won. Because you're just Carl Malone. Yeah, I'm trying to, I'm trying to Carl Malone, yeah, yeah. I, I turned it into more of a Jeff Hornacek, Carl though. Malone. If you could be Carl absolutely Malone, Carl Malone. put these oh. more in a, a Wait, no, hold on, Nick's onto something but, there. I, I don't see the connection exactly, but Carl Malone, Home Alone is something that I need to figure out the answer to. <laughs> Carl Malone, sporting a bone, watching oh, no. Home Alone, eating some provolone. Nice. On the porcelain throne. Oh. Oh. Well, oh. The great innovator strikes again. That's, we got to call it. That's that's done. While listening to banana phone. <laughs> I like it. But he only hears a dial tone. And at Maybe. the same time, he has to look into the kitchen to watch his scones. Well, I think we're losing it. Well, his house the overlooks the fine ocean sea foam. 
and he paints a portrait of Ray Barone. <laughs> and touches himself. While shouting, Tyrone! <laughs> I never want to be alone! <laughs> Screaming into the microphone! I'll never let you go, Tyrone! While munching well, on Ikea it. bread covered in provolone? <laughs> We, we started we with Provolone. again. <laughs> Thanks for watching the Tournament of Shame, everybody. Uh, I actually brought this one in. Oh, my bad. <laughs> yep. Do you take you, your impression of me, of what I just said? Hey, everybody. This is uh, Bear Taffy signing out. Can you the next time. Signing out. I'm oh, Bear like, Taffy. Instantly. Bear <laughs> Taffy. I'm Bear Taffy, and I have a great announcer voice. Bear Taffy. It's like it's an insult, but it's not at all. Because no, I was going to say, if you're trying to attack my insecurities, I've got this list. Yeah, that's... I would. Well, you asked for it, Victor. <laughs> Don't blame me. I did. Hey, everybody, welcome to the thousand and first episode of The Binding of Isaac. <laughs> Hey, wow. what's up, everybody? Really excited to be here. This is former Big Brother winner Dan Giesling. <laughs> I can hear it. We had uh, one comment this week. That's a 2.5 thousand percent oh, increase oh. on less. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Get him. Get him. Uh, roasted. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody well, go comment some on Dan's video to, no, don't. to I, disprove that theorem. I, I don't want your pity. I just want your Ikea bread. That's all, man. Just <laughs> You can have some <laughs> Ikea bread, Dan. As, uh, as long as you tell me what the capital of Vermont is. Mont PBA. It's actually correct. <laughs> I, that oh took me by God. surprise. And if you guys want to... Uh, been the greatest outro ever. If you guys yeah, want to call are. Ryan, uh, let me get his cell phone real quick. You can dial him at... Don't even, yeah. man. <laughs> Hold <That's>... on. <laughs> Ryan, you're in my phone is Ryan line. 778. I'm just joking. No, like, actually, don't do that, <laughs> I'm though. Not. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. That's not even your... That, that might even be a step too far as is. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta edit that one out. Uh, yeah, that one's good. We want cut. people to know what the area code of Vancouver <laughs> <laughs> Yo, there's two area codes here, man. Oh, shit. All right. Well, they're whittling that, it down a bit. That gives me plausible uh, deniability. I don't, I don't know what we're supposed to do. Do we end the video? Oh, this part's never seen the light of day on my channel. So. Oh, all right. Well, thanks, thanks for watching, everybody. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Everyone's going to get Northern Lights. Phone number in my comments below. See you.